Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of Tinkering with Tech Tech. In this episode, I'm going to be going over using an MCP3008 chip. What this chip does is it gives the Raspberry Pi analog inputs. And what that does is it allows you to use various sensors and all different types of inputs to your Raspberry Pi for really cool control systems. So, without further ado, let's get right into it. First, we're going to connect leads to the input side of the MCP3008 chip. Be sure to note which direction the half circle is on so that you can tell which side is which. Now, let's connect VDD and VREF to the 3.3 volt supply on the Pi. Then, let's connect A, G, N, D, and D, G, N, D to ground on the Raspberry Pi. Then connect CLK to pin 23. Connect D out to pin 21. Connect D in to pin 19. And connect CS slash S H D N to pin 24. Now let's connect the potentiometer. The left and right leads will go to the 3.3 volt supply and the ground on the Raspberry Pi. And the middle lead goes to channel 0 on the MCP3008 chip. Now, let's install the Adafruit-Blinka and Adafruit circuit libraries using the following commands. Finally, run the following code to loop reading the input values from channel 0. Now we can see as we rotate the potentiometer, the output resistance value changes. Hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you like what you see, check out one of my other videos using the links on your screen. And if you would like to see more great content like this, make sure to like, subscribe, or even check out our Patreon in the link below.